Hello friends. Welcome to my new Java programming tutorial series video. Today, we will discuss, how to determine system properties in Java. Let's move ahead to Eclipse and see how this concept works. The system class maintains a properties object, that describes the configuration of the current working environment. System properties include information about the current user, the current version of the Java runtime, and the character used to separate components of a file path name. Friends. In order to demonstrate its working, let's create a Java class. We will name it as, System Properties. Provided a main method. Click Finish. Friends. Let's start by creating a string variable Java version. This variable will store property value of currently installed Java version. In order to get that property value, we use system class get property method. This method takes in a name of system property and returns back the value of system property. In our case, name of the property is java.version. Moving ahead. Create a string variable java home. This variable will store property value of install java home path. Similarly, we use system class get property method. The property name is java.home. Moving ahead. Let's determine current operating system name. Create a string variable os name. This variable will store property value of operating system name. Similarly, we use system class get property method. The property name is os.name. So friends. Let's move ahead and print values of system properties on the Java console. Using system.out.println method, we output system property names and values on console. Let's move ahead and run the Java program. It prints Java version 1.70 underscore 25 Java home C program files Java JRE7 Operating system name Windows 8 Moving ahead System class internally maintains a properties object which has name and values for all the system properties. Let's print on the Java console each property name and its associated values. In order to do that, first create a properties instance by name system properties. Assign it a value using system.getPropertiesMethod. method. In order to print each property name and value, we have to first extract unique names of property in a set. Create a set variable by name set of system properties. This set will contain collection of names of properties. Moving ahead. Using for each loop, 
we will iterate over set of system properties one by one. Using system.getProperty method as described above, we will extract each and every name value pair and print it on the Java console. Let's move ahead and run the Java program. Here, you can see name value pair of all system properties. So friends, Go through this video two to three times so that, how to determine system properties in Java concept gets more clear to you. Hope you like this video. Please give one minute to like, share, comment or subscribe my channel, or you can visit my website at www.hubberspot.com.